Hello guys. So today we're walking uh, another road. It's October 27th and the road is called Booth Hill. And it's it's in the line between uh, like Monroe and Trumbull, I believe, but also Shell. And it's like kind of in that trio. But um, we just had like, we parked at, um, we're, we're walking the part that is like a little bit like almost like urban and there's not many houses. Mm -hmm. There's and, a dog uh, that was using its mind. Yeah, and then they like played like this police sound effect. It's kind of weird. weird. Yeah. It sounded like an alien. Yeah, it was a little strange. So, but show yep. them the road. Right now we're gonna get ready. There's the road. So, uh, if you guys have seen our sawmill video, it's kind of similar to that, and it's not too far from there. We were actually uh, doing the the Legends of Fear, which is on saw. Well. It's like the farm. Oh, oh shit, there it is. And it's on the yeah, um, maybe this is the stop their dog, but doesn't, it's kind of weird though, because their dog stopped, stop. their dog stopped like a like couple of minutes ago, so it's kind of weird. Yeah. That's why the camera stays right there. Yeah. Let me, uh, park the car. Lock the car. Just to be sure I hear a car coming. Yeah, there is, there is some good amount of activity. It is currently, I think, around 9.30 right now, so... There's a sound again, and a car coming. Yeah, so there might be a good amount of activity. I mean, it's a Friday night, so yeah. people are out and about or whatever. And this isn't that far from Sawmills, so. Yeah. I mean, I'm not saying these people are going there. Yeah. The people are out. Also, just to elaborate, we were going to walk on Sawmill, but there was too many cars. Yeah. If, we, uh, if you saw our video last year. Yeah. Um, remember, it, well, you may or may not remember, we said we might have to come at a later time next year because of the activity is yeah. too busy, but I don't the know. fact of the matter is we, we got a ticket like uh There's a 7.30 7, ticket for Legends of Fear. So we, we were like, okay, we'll count how many cars go down the road because we, we had to drive down it or we chose to drive down it and we encountered what was it, 23 cars? Uh, yeah, 23 cars just driving down yeah, it. Yeah, so we said we said if we encounter three, we'll do it. But was, <laughs> yeah, that was way past yeah, it. Was, it. You know, There's no way it was going to be working. Expected, so. I mean, it did kind of calm down a little bit when we were like, we were kind yeah, of sitting there wondering where to go. Waves, so we didn't want to yeah. like, just have a light show. It was, it was just going to be a repeat of like last year. But, so. but probably worse. <laughs> yeah. But we figured we'd give a new road a shot. Yeah, this road, um, just a little backstory, I guess. Uh, there isn't really any, it's not really associated to anything haunted unless something happens, but uh, this road I used to, like when I was younger, I used to like have driven down it as like a kid because it was like basically a connecting road to my grandparents' house. So basically that's how I know this road. And I remember I used to be scared of it when I was younger because it just is so very, like, it's, really it's very, empty. Yeah, it's very empty and like abandoned looking. Almost similar also, to a sawmill, except more. It's cool because this is like foresty, but then it goes out into something. Else. Yeah, it's all like it goes straight out. It's kind of openish, but. Yeah. What the hell was that? I don't know. It's like a weird noise. This is a creepy ass road. The thing that there the is thing some is, creepy noises I'm hearing. Yeah, I will. Sometimes when you when you go to like a birds, yeah, just animal <laughs> sounds. One thing I find is when you go to the ones that are known for being haunted, <laughs> they're almost like they don't have any activity. Oh. But then you go somewhere like this where it's like yeah. doesn't have that, it's, and it's just like. 
There's a car coming. coming. On the other side, we're good. <laughs> but yeah, that's why it's fun to just find kind of abandoned looking roads. Yeah. Just keep looking on the map for, uh, just look for roads that don't have many cars on it or look like they're special. Smells kind of bad. Yeah, that was a weird smell. <laughs> I was like, oh, oh my god, holy shit. Yeah. It's a swamp. Swamp? Yeah. yeah. That's so weird though. Like, yeah, that's like a swamp. Like, you could literally drive off right off the road. I'm not even kidding. Yeah. It is like two feet off the road. Like, someone could literally land in the swamp. Smells There's like no. Weird shit. Yeah, birds are fucking. Birds are getting wild. <laughs> They're getting quirky at night. I think it's the day because they see us. But that is like disturbing that like someone could literally go right into the There's swamp. The you you would think there would be a guardrail, but. Like... Yeah, there's nowhere to step out of the way. Yeah, it, it smelled a little bit weird, but it's probably because there's like a, a marsh or something over there, I think. Yeah. I was looking at the map, that's what it looked like. But yeah, we were going to walk down Sawmill, but uh, not yeah, tonight. This is honestly better, though. Yeah, I mean, we've walked down Sawmill. So well, we recorded it once, technically. Well, <laughs> we, I think I have... I think you I have, have footage, footage, but it has been uploaded upload yet. It, yeah. I have it on my channel, but it's on this, too. Well, one of these days we'll get it up on. Yeah. Freaking wild ass birds. Yeah. But, uh, yeah, I mean, we've walked down Sawmill, like, the two of us, like, three times now. Oh, it's been more than three. Yeah. No, it's, it's been, like, three times, I think. We've been there, like, m four times because we tried finding a geocache in, like, March of 2022, no, but we, we couldn't find it. No, it's only been like three times, technically, in the dark. I guess. Maybe I'm just like, because we've done a bunch of it. Yeah. Well, we've been to like many, well, places, I guess, but. Yeah. If nothing eventful happens, which just seems like there's some stuff going on already, but. <laughs> there's like gonna... weird bird noises. Yeah, bird there's like the freaking, like, siren noises. Like, that's like yeah, great siren, welcoming. The siren noises. <laughs> We got the welcoming committee already. <laughs> yeah, I don't know what the explanation is for that uh, police siren noise that they're doing at that house. I'm not too educated on random police siren noises at someone's house. What? I said what? I couldn't hear you. Well, I was just like oh, talking about sirens. like the, yeah, I don't know why they were doing that. Yeah, that was weird. But... We're also going to do a side thing where we review the five minutes of Friday. Oh, yeah. Well, yeah, we will. Uh, so since this is October 27th, uh, last night, we saw the FNAF movie in yeah. theaters. The first and, night it came out. Yeah, the first. It technically is supposed to come out on the 27th, but it came out a little earlier um, yeah, for whatever reason. Do that, like, they do it, yeah, the day before yeah, or whatever. Like the second half of It's like 24-hour notice type of thing. Yeah. And the movie was, uh, if you're, if you had seen, okay, so if you're basically a fan of FNAF, then you might like some things, but if you have no interest in it, have, don't have, have never played a FNAF game in your life, you most likely won't be, uh, too into it. <laughs> yeah, we're just assuming that. This is a little off topic with the road, but this is kind of open the way that. see the car? And it disappeared. What are you talking about? I could have sworn there was a car coming. Well, mate, the video should have caught it if that was the case. There might be a hill or something. <laughs> well, there is kind of a hill, but it would have... Isn't there a light up ahead? There's a car coming this way. Uh, well, there is some houses up there, so yeah, someone could have turned their lights on or something. Right. Yeah, but this, uh, no ATVs. Yeah, this goes out a good amount. 
good distance out. But yeah, the Fnaf movie was it was. It was kind of it was like all over the place. The plot was kind of just. It wasn't. There was a lot of plot holes, I would say. I personally really liked it. It was funny. Yeah. I would uh. For the right reasons, but like it was just some things that happened. They just were really funny when in my head. Yeah, I mean, yeah, there was obviously we have this like weird sense of humor where like something stupid happens that's like unexpected like that one of the animatronics bonnie i guess he like drops like a chair <laughs> and it also falls over it's just funny and it's supposed to be a horror movie but like yeah, it's it basically turned out to be like a thriller with like a heavy narrative yeah. and they like tried piecing it together but there was like so many like weird had, like, things that... moment, uh, I, I don't know if this would be a spoiler but they were like spoilers could happen positively with the animatronics i'm like come on yeah it, i i referred to it as like an anime over it's like just weird it, it didn't make sense what i mean is that like it seemed out of it just seemed out of character for the movie because it's supposed to be kind of scary or whatever <clears throat> basically all the animatronics and like the main characters in the movie so maybe the car was going this way and yeah so it's this way oh no it should be this oh, way this but way. yeah basically all the like the animatronics and the characters they just started like making like a pillow fort and they were all like laying on the ground together and just yeah, was like <laughs> it was just so weird yeah, it, it, it like just completely movie. like just made it like just out of character for the movie because it's supposed to be like kind of scary when it was just like it just made it goofy. <laughs> yeah. It just, I think the, the movie kind of lacked, like, an identity, it I guess. A, it was <laughs> advertised as a horror movie. But yeah, and great. then it turned out to be a thriller with a narrative. Right. And then they just threw in this part where they just were all together. Like, yeah. nothing was going on. It wasn't that scary, either. It had, like, some moments. But, like, I don't think I would feel scared if I watched it again. Yeah, it we didn't fall really... back in our seat. Yeah. Yeah, but anyway, in terms of this road, uh, we're getting into like the more street light oriented part, which isn't really that scary. So, yeah, we can turn the flash. Yeah, there's a car coming. Yeah, <gasps> yeah this road isn't that scary. No, well, now we're in the part with, like, actual street lights, so it's, like, it's, like, someone just turned the lights on when we're watching a scary movie, and it's, like, okay, time for bed. Yeah, we're in the area where you have to have a booze. <laughs> yeah. It was, a, it was, it was, a, I liked it. Yeah, I would still good. say if you're like a fan of like the Five Nights at Freddy's game. games, then you might like it, but they had good candy yeah, it's more of a fan based thing than anything. Right. Definitely not good if you're not like into like, uh, yeah, I wouldn't, recommend it. I wouldn't recommend it to people that aren't a fan of Five Nights at Freddy's, but well, at least something horror related, I guess, or yeah. almost horror related for Halloween. <clears throat> Yeah, we're definitely getting out of the, uh, now we're just, like, in a, we're on, like, the normal street part. <laughs> like yeah, like, the, the, kind of the scary part was pretty short. Yeah. You hear that, like, uh, not the birds, but the other sound? like a repeated sound. It sounds like a vibration almost. Uh, I don't know, I haven't picked up on it yet. You probably hear it use it's hard to identify it, but it but it's just kinda of interesting to me. I don't know if it's bugs. I think it's bugs. It's not the crickets but it's the other side. That was a heavy cricket noise. I 
yeah i don't know how much longer we have but um yeah this i mean we're i kind of wanted to walk down this road just mainly for that particular part with just like the no street lights and no houses it just reminds me does the rest of it have lights yeah scary dog I mean, yeah, we probably could just like turn back or whatever, but yeah, if you want to. Yeah, because it's probably not much. Yeah. scary dog moment. <laughs> yeah, the dog is a, is being a nuisance. She's gonna eat the beavers. <laughs> They have great communication skills. How long have you been filming? Uh, 16, almost 17 minutes. It's cool. like a good amount. Yeah, it's fair well, enough. Have to do like a crazy long video. Yeah, that's good enough, I guess. The dog is going this, this in the so It really does look so bad. Yeah. Is there even any street lights? Oh, wait. I thought that, I thought that was the street. <laughs> no. This is Winfield. Uh, Winfield Drive. It doesn't look like there's anything. Oh, dead, end. dead end. Yeah, guys. Also, um, if you if, if there's actually any people that this are watching, well, technically, yeah. Yeah. in the rules of the road, if you're walking it, you stay to the left because you want to go. You walk. Yeah, you gotta walk against traffic, but. Um, anyway, if there's any people out there that are actually watching our videos this far in, like, let us know if there's any roads that you want us to walk down, or if you just want us to walk down, like, every road yeah. in Connecticut. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't know any Connecticut roads, I mean, obviously that would be ideal, but if, it, if it's, like, a really good road that's within, like, <laughs> like close to Connecticut... We might be able to, but ideally... Yeah, be. well, I think there's probably a lot of roads in Connecticut yeah, that are kind of like this, but it's just the like... The explorers of Connecticut, not the windmill explorers of New England. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, like, we so we can't go all the way to, like, New Jersey or something. Yeah. That probably would take too long. <laughs> what the hell? It's like beeping noises. Yeah. Woods, <laughs> what is it? Woods state, Grove. We just had nothing to say. <laughs> yeah, we just walked down like, it yeah, with no, no, well, no words. <laughs> we, we don't say anything. We're just be like, yeah, we're just we're tired. We're just gonna walk and be done. We're going home. <laughs> yeah, this road trip is exhausting. We vlog it, then we don't do anything. That would That'd be, be so really depressing. Like, joke video. You just do a vlog where you're going somewhere, and instead of doing something, that you just turn around. <laughs> Yeah. Because <laughs> that's like the kind of content you would make. <laughs> Wasting gas. <laughs> Driving and turning. I think I heard my cousin do that once. Like, he went somewhere and he turned around. <laughs> <laughs> this sounds so silly. I know, because it is. Yeah, the cars have been... Oh wait, speak of the devil, there's a car. <laughs> Oh, he's going quickly. Gonna gotta, gotta get on the side of the road. Get to safety. Oh, man. Oh, they became, they became European friends. Oh, 
Yeah. They broke the law for going 10 miles over the speed limit. So this is public access by permit only, so we can't go walking in there. Yeah. We don't want to walk into the territory of anybody's uh, presence or whatever. Yeah. Oh yeah, we also have to pay attention that there is a classic rock wall right there for dividing property. And we got a car driving quickly right there. Yeah, water supply sign. It's coming fast. There it goes. It's a Kia. Yeah. Oh, did I? Oh, my, I think, well, yeah, my, my shoe's untied a little bit. I think we might need to take a shoe tying break. All the cars are coming. Oh my god, there's so many cars. Jesus Christ, man. My shoes untied, guys. Do you want to record? I have to pee. Do you want to do you want to tie All right. my pee? All right. Well, we got to do like here we'll, we'll, the recording. Or we can go like this. We can use nature. Okay, nature. You can help me. You can look at this tree right here. I'm going to like I'm gonna go like this and tie my shoe. Yeah. I almost started. I actually did start. You gotta, you gotta time it. You gotta like. Wait, let me shine the flashlight. All right, shoe tying complete. Let's get the phone and flashlight. See, this is like an obstacle course. You gotta, you gotta go off into the woods, unfortunately. Yeah, I'll, just do, I'll just do it later. <laughs> I'll just do it later. I'll save it for later, maybe next time. I'll, I'll, I'll charge it up. I'm trying to charge it up. I'm gonna use my splatter shot later. Oh my, my flashlight's flickering a little bit. This walk went from really scary to beginning to. Yeah, my, uh, I think my flashlight's going out. Oh, man. Oh, man. There's a car. Alright, good luck. We can listen to those like the freaking bird noises. Also, guys, look at the full moon up there. That's crazy. And we got this guy coming right, right at us. I changed my mind. <laughs> Just like rolling the dice every like minute. <laughs> yeah, guys, I wanted to also point out that we have a full moon tonight, which is very nice. Yeah. Very cool. This is a pissing hard challenge. Yeah. This you're you're going to have to like walk like have a to name this one bladders and breaking it. Bladder, well, we're technically not on sawmill. Okay, well, let's let the cars pass. Oh, what'd you say? We're, we're technically not on sawmill though. Yeah, but, uh, oh, are we not good? Yeah, but we, we were still there. Yeah, but we didn't walk sawmill, yeah, so. But we, but we were. We, we did the trail. Yeah, we didn't, we didn't we walk sawmill, though. Yeah, but we did the hang ride. That counts. Well, it's technically sawmill, though, because that's where the melon heads are. Yeah, so it counts. But that's, like, the farm. That's not that's not sawmill, though. Okay, well, then the streak is broken and we'll never do it again. Yeah, unless we go on, like, Halloween night or something. Yeah. <laughs> we, we should only trick, it, trick or treat on the, the houses on the end. Yeah, you have to like walk down the dirt roads because well, sawmill has like those those uh, driveways that are like dirt roads, but you they're like literally like freaking like fifty car lengths or something, like they're like a really good distance up the road. 
Don't look. Okay, good luck. Again. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm not gonna do that. Let's just enjoy the atmosphere. There's a weird noise that just happened. It sounds like a freaking dog like yelping or something. That was weird. You got it all done? Yeah, I just had the primal urge to mark my territory. Yeah. Well, we're, we're glad that you got it all done. Yeah, I didn't even have to go. King, king size, that's what it says. We got a, another like can. And we got a car up Some, there. <laughs> when we walk my dog, sometimes when we're outside of a house that she knows there's a dog, she start peeing. <laughs> She'll, she won't even like pee fully. She'll just like pee a little bit. Well, yeah, they they mark their feet. territory. Yeah, that's just like the way that dogs are. Like, Belle will often do that or whatever. She chooses to only pee some. Yeah. She's saving it for to mark more territory. Yeah, and it's very it's kind of weird, but that's just how they communicate. It's not really weird. It's just funny. Yeah. Like I get why, but what the fuck was that? It might have been from Saul. <laughs> yeah, they just had a massive explosion. Oh, Sawmill is probably like three miles away or something now. Yeah, that's still it's not that far. Car coming. Car on the way now. Oh man. Yeah, that wouldn't been that nice. This is menacing. It smells like shit. Yeah, it smells weird. It's like a it's like a burned wood chip smell Actually, or something. Yeah, the wood chip was not bad, but when it smells like bird shit. Yeah. It smells very weird. It's like a burning smell. Is there like other channels on the internet that does this? Uh, probably. So we, we I mean, it's them. just like most likely, like, I mean, most people are more like, sane to not walk down a freaking abandoned or like dark road like this in the middle, middle of the night. night yeah. <laughs> yeah, like, I mean, it's just like unhinged. <laughs> like, why would you do this? <laughs> Be like okay, so like number one, well, like you're insane, <laughs> and two, like did you like did your balls grow like three times the size when <laughs> you did this? Like the Grinch, but it grows. <laughs> yeah, instead of the heart, it's your ball sack. <laughs> we're, we're the cock. Another funny thing is we record the entire thing, then <laughs> we just upload it raw. Yeah, it's raw. It, it's too long. Oh yeah, we got. Look at that, we got a little stream right here. It, like it's foaming at the mouth. Yeah. It goes right into there. I'm assuming that should be the marsh over there. Yeah. And we got a car coming to add to the experience. And another car coming. I stepped on a can. Oh man. Oh Jesus. Whoa, it just got chilly. That was weird. It actually, like, there's like a breeze. Uh, yeah, I feel it. No dumping allowed. No dumping allowed. Oh, yeah, you can't take a shit here. Should, and in public access by permit only. <laughs> yeah, it'd be like five minute video. Yeah, but this be funny. yeah well, I guess we could maybe. But there is also, so there is a rule. We didn't provide any context. For Horny Town? Yeah, for Horny Well, I did actually explain it in a video once of the, like. Office channel? No, well, the office park. Basically, uh, my rule is because uh, we see, like, the office park is, like, a sanctuary. So, like, we can only go there, like, when we have, like, 100 subscribers or something, yeah, like, yeah. special like that. Because it's a, a very important place. <clears throat> yeah, but, well, we're actually... 
many subs have So we actually have gained a few subs recently. Oh. We were up to like, <laughs> we're up to 12 subscribers. Oh, shit. Which is crazy. Also, we only have 88 to go. I, I think I might have been one of those new subs. I think I realized I wasn't subscribed. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Well, I we'll just keep wrong. working I on it, I guess. I swear I subscribed not that long ago. Yeah. Yeah, there's my car up ahead, so. Yeah, we're 30 minutes into the video, so that's a pretty good length. Yeah. We got some normal road in here, and we got the, the scary, almost similar to Sawmill City Road. Better known as Melonhead Road, but this is just a regular road. Yeah, maybe. Yeah. All right, well, we'll go on this side. We should do one like that dude, where we make like a really weird... We just show how we make it, and then we. Hide. Yeah, we would have to come up with an idea. <laughs> I wish that got made more of those videos. Yeah, those are, are funny. Those are uh, in case you guys are wondering what we're talking about, it's Bub Films. He like made a, a geocaching video, or he made he made a video of him making a geocache, and it was like really elaborate, yeah, where he took like a big log. One, yeah, really so like Bub Films or whatever. If you're watching this, make another geocaching video. It was very good. More geocaching content. Yeah, I know. We got too much like wholesome geocaching content. We need like some unhinged ones yeah, too. We need, we need to introduce <laughs> some like non like fifty year olds to the geocaching. Yeah. There's a lot of a lot of geocaching YouTubers. Which there's nothing wrong with that, but Yeah. We need, we need oh my god, is this like a little trail? Yeah, I noticed that. I want to like walk a little bit in there. It could be someone's property, so yeah. But it does look like it's like a little stream or something. It's like a road. Yeah, we're streaming. Okay, guys, we're streaming right now. Yeah, that was like back in. Oh, I was just freaking out for a second. My flashlight. No, that was mine. It was blinking. Oh, okay. But yeah. That was a streaming joke in, um, yeah. like, Old Derby Historic Indian Trail video. <laughs> Very silly, but, uh, anyway, so yeah, I think we're done here, guys. We're back at the car, so, um, if you actually made it this far into the video, uh, thank you for watching. Um, I don't know, I'm, I'm assuming we'll go, uh, to another Melonhead Road or something like that next, or yeah. we'll see, I guess, what happens. Um... So, Thanks for watching. Thank you for watching the video and see you in the next video.